Welcome back to the Adventures of Happy Hours. In our last episode, Towboat US arrived and saved the day a month after Hurricane Ian washed our boat ashore. By some miracle of fate, the boat didn't sink when put back in the water. In this episode, we inspect the boat, check the damages, and attempt to fire up the engines. So stick around. The house batteries look good. I think I'm going to charge, turn on the generator. Alright, so that's not cranking. I don't know if it's batteries or what, but... Alright, now I want to check the fluids in the engines. I like to get everything started as quick as possible. Bilge pumps were running a little bit. We got a little standing water there, but nothing to worry about. I don't see any water coming in. I'm gonna get a new dipstick for this engine. It oil looks good there. Doesn't look like there's water in it. That's a good sign. I want to still crank these engines and see how they go. Yep. That's good. We got water pressure. Let's see. We have voltage 13.914. Low on fuel. That's the fuel. That's the tank that we uh, drained a lot of the, siphoned a lot of the gas out for our generators. Oil pressure's good. Water pressure's good. Yeah. Port. It would, it uh, goes under the boat, the exhaust. All right, starboard engine, start it up. No, you don't see water come out. They're looking for water coming out of the exhaust, but this boat's made differently. <laughs> Okay, we got water pressure. Okay, temperature's coming up. 109 on the port. Yeah, no water coming out your exhaust. Yeah, you don't, it goes, it doesn't come out the side. Yeah. No, it doesn't. It, it, it goes through the exhaust and it comes under, underwater. That's a good sign. Let's see if this generator will start. Yeah, I gotta pull the plugs on this. I'm wondering if this is hydro locked. May have gotten some uh, water in there. Didn't get it on camera, but we um, put the boat in gear and everything sounds good. There's no leaks from the shafts. Um, I got a little dribble coming from one of the rudders, but that's normal. It's been dry, so we'll give that a little bit of time for the packing to Is swell up. Yeah. Yep. That's it. So uh, we put it in gear, each engine, and no problems. No noises, no leaks. A miracle, really. Well, the electronics seem to work, too. Even my backup camera. The finder works. First time at our dock. Temperatures at 159 at each engine.
Oil pressure is good. Water pressure. That's amazing that I, I cannot believe that everything's working. <laughs> yep. Let's see. Is the radio working? Oh, I don't have a. My antenna's broken. I'm, ch I'm trying to check the radio, and I don't think my antenna's on. No, let me, let me put all these seats back. You want to give me a hand with this seat? I want to get this back on. It sort of latches in. You see those? Yeah. It's just heavy. I'm not... There's like little holes in the back of the plastics. I gotta. I don't have to go crazy, just sit it in there. That's gonna have to get reupholstered. In? All right, good. Yeah, nice, comfortable seat. <laughs> oh, it's alive! Even the autopilot is working. It's uh, unbelievable. I'm just, I'm amazed. That's I really am. Very good. Yeah. I can't wait to go for a test drive with it. <laughs> yeah, I think we're good. The rest is. Uh, gotta watch it yeah, I gotta. Watch. I got. This is what I'm gonna be focusing on for the next week or so. <laughs> no more housework. <laughs> yeah, we'll change the pace there a little bit. They did a good job not bending the rails too. Yeah, I was worried of it. They yeah, put the straps great. underneath it. So that they didn't bend it. This is just this was an old cover. I have a new one already for it. So it's gonna need gel coat work, but we're looking good. Now the real work begins.